from the Ford Sports Desk, KOMU 8 Sports. Well, good morning, everyone. The Missouri Tigers will visit the Arkansas Razorbacks tonight at Bud Walton Arena in Fayetteville. While Mizzou is 3-3 three three in SEC play, the Hogs are just 2-4. and four. Arkansas has already played three overtime games during conference play. They beat Kentucky but lost to Florida and Georgia. Last season, Missouri and Arkansas split their two games. The Hogs won a very close contest in Fayetteville, and the Tigers won a lopsided game in Columbia. That score at home last year was 93-63. Former Missouri coach Mike Anderson has taken his fastest 40 minutes of basketball to Arkansas. The Tigers say that they'll be watching for those fast-paced plays. The Arkansas is a team that pushes the ball very hard. Uh, they deny passes. Um, they're really good. They have quick hands. Um, just, just being strong with the ball and just making strong moves and don't be weak and just being able to complete plays. The pressure is something we we got to be concerned with. Uh, you know, handling the handling the ball. We got to meet passes. Um, we got to keep them off the offensive glass. They go to the offensive glass really hard. Um, I mean, it's going to be one of those games where it's going to be physical, active, hard. Play. I mean, we got to play hard. They got to play hard. They're going to play hard. Playing under control, you know, they're good at speeding people up, but, you know, you can only, they can only play as fast as you let them, you know, make you play. So you're just trying to stay under control and, you know, you know, making the plays that we want to make. And here's a look at high school girls basketball from last night. A Capital City showdown between Helias and Jefferson City at Fleming Fieldhouse. Dan Ridgway's Lady Jays start off pretty well. In the fourth quarter, Kaziah Martin is a two-pointer, and the score is tied at two. Then, later on in that quarter, Megan Foster comes in with the layup. Score tied at four, but the Crusaders would pull away. Lucy Franco layup to end the first quarter, up 9-5 to five, Helias. Second quarter, Bailey Franco comes in three-pointer, 12-5 to five, Helias. Fourth quarter, Megan Napier layup, 33-21 Helias. The final score here is going to be Helias 44, Jefferson City 30. And a quick look at the NCAA men's basketball rankings here for week 13. Arizona undefeated 20 and 0 on the lead, followed by Syracuse and then Florida, still undefeated in SEC conference play, San Diego wrapping up that top five. Kansas City hanging in at number six, and Oklahoma State also in the top ten, although Oklahoma State lost to number 23 Oklahoma last night on the road. Kentucky is the SEC's other ranked team coming in here at number 11. You got the St. Louis Billikens making the list at number 19, and your Texas Longhorns will round out the top 25 for this week. This week, Kansas State and Baylor both dropped off the rankings. Missouri didn't receive any votes for Week 13. That's sports this morning. KMU8 News will be right back.